Hey what's going on everyone this is Kedar here and today in this video on social security how to pay your bills and debt using your social security number and how to use your social security number to pay off your debt so guys today in this video we'll be discussing a common question that many people have in the community how do you pay off your debt how do you pay your bills with the social security number formerly known as SSN so if you are dealing with the debt and you wanted to get on top of your finances then you came to the right place this video is gonna be very important for you so watch this video till the end and actually before getting into all the details i wanted to make this very very clear that first thing you need to ask is it even possible to use your social security number to pay off your debt i mean some people think like social security card is basically like your credit card or your debit card so you can put in your numbers and pay off bills debt basically you can use it like a credit card or debit card well if you think so then this video is for you make sure to watch this video till the end now believe me i I did a lot of research on this topic and actually I found out two group of people. First group of people say yes it's totally possible and other group of people say it's not possible at all. So here you can see the first one the truth of the matter is yes it works. This fellow is saying yes you can pay off your debt with social security number and his argument is that you can use your social security number as checking your account number then apply one of three routing numbers where your social security account is holding off your money however many years of work and I paid off my light bills, gas bill, water bills, sewage bills doing this one and I did not have any debt to apply it but I can confirm it does indeed work. So guys hold on for a moment because we really need to deep dive into this important topic because right here from the board of governors federal reserves we have got the actual answer and one way or another the question goes like this does the federal reserve maintain accounts for individuals and can individuals use these accounts the social security numbers to pay off their bills and get money out of social security number today in this video we'll be answering this question there is a very bad consequence of using bank routing numbers can lead to some serious consequences so guys without further ado let's jump right into it quickly before we start make sure to subscribe to our channel how to guys make sure to hit that like share this video and without further ado let's jump right into it all right guys so let's answer is it possible to use your social security number to pay off your debt so the first important thing to understand whether you are trying to pay off your bills or debt you need to use valid payment methods such as credit card debit card or check probably bank transfer and now let's say if you have an outstanding debt and you wanted to make a payment using social security number or SSN so where did this myth come from it's unclear but it's very likely that it stems from misunderstanding that how social security works. now social security is a program that provides retirement disability SSI SSDI survivors benefits to eligible individuals now when you receive your social security benefits they are typically paid out through the direct deposit into your bank account now remember guys those benefits will be paid out into the bank account that you specify however the bank account is not a federal bank account and it's not linked to your social security number in any way other than being used as a means of receiving your benefits so this is very important guys be sure you note this fact and it's also worth noting that there are certain government funded accounts such as provided by veterans administrations or the department of defense that are linked to the personal military service account number or other identity information however remember the social security number are never used as a means for accessing these accounts unfortunately the thing you need to understand is that it's not possible to use your social security number to pay off your debt simply because the reason is your social security number that is your SSN is an account number similar to an bank account or credit card account number it's just a number so remember it's just a number that's used to identify where you and your employer are contributing to your social security funds so remember guys the social security number is basically the identification number so this identifies where you and your employer are contributing in the social security funds this is the significance of the social security number now the number the social security number doesn't work anything itself so that's the reason because it's not worth anything it has no value when attempting to pay off your debt one thing you should remember if somebody is claiming it's magical it simply works there is no magic in the real world guys the where the money is basically coming from that's the question you need to ask yourself there is no such a thing such as free money when it involves the government if they would have done such thing then cost would be too high then please be careful in one of the article hovering over the internet i saw that the social security numbers are linked to your federal bank accounts however guys 
this is not simply true this claim is false the social security numbers are not linked to any federal bank account and they cannot be used as a means for accessing any type of a government funded account in fact onto the social security administration ssa webpage they explicitly state that they do not maintain any type of a bank account for individuals also they warn against the fraudulent schemes that are involving scammers claiming that your social security number have access to these federal bank accounts linked to the person's social security number well these claims are simply false and used to trick many individuals who providing their personal information to their scammers and you know what once your social security number is leaked then it can be used for identity theft and other fraudulent activities so be aware of this issue and here is the thing federal reserve bank has issued an official statement about this thing the scam which is revolving around the community many people are putting this hoax into the community that it really works you can pay off your bills and debts with social security number and regarding that federal reserve has and made an official statement let me show you that and heads on to the federal reserve system page the question goes like this does the federal reserve maintain the accounts for individuals and can individuals use such accounts to pay bills and get money now the clear cut answer is no federal reserve bank provide financial services to banks and governmental entities only so not individuals remember guys federal reserves provide financial services to banks and government entities only not for individuals individuals cannot by law have accounts at the federal reserve now many people believe such thing because there is a recent hoax going on circulating in the community and hoax basically says like federal reserve maintains account for individuals that are tied to individuals social security number and that individuals can access this numbers the social security number and thereby the accounts to pay off their bills and obtain the money now these claims are totally false federal reserve does not maintain accounts for individuals and individuals should not attempt to make payments using federal reserve bank routing numbers remember guys there is a very bad consequence of doing so because using bank routing numbers or false routing numbers can lead to some serious consequences now individuals who attempt to pay their bills or conduct other transactions using federal reserve bank routing numbers may face penalty fees right from the company they were attempting to pay or probably suspension or closure of their commercial bank or payment service provider account and this one including federal bureau of investigation that is fbi you know fbi is aware of the scam and individuals who participate in such schemes could also face criminal charges so it's that serious guys now if somebody is trying to scam you through this scheme then if you are a victim then victims of the internet frauds are advised to make a report to the fbi internet crime complaint center to get further help seriously guys i cannot wrap my head around why people believe this and that's why how the scams continue to work remember your social security number isn't a credit card or debit card the government doesn't hold your accounts that you can access based on your social security number there is no cool way to get money that you didn't earn there is no free lunch no free money the only number that works is the credit card number debit card number your social security number is just basically account number which is used to identify you and you can't purchase anything with your social security number ssn it has no value except to identify you so in conclusion the claim that social security numbers are linked to the federal bank account it's simply not true the social security numbers are used to identify individuals who are eligible for the social security benefit but they are not used as a means for accessing any type of government funded accounts and it's always important to be aware of these fraudulent schemes and protect yourself and your personal information from potential scammers thanks for watching this video make sure to hit that like share this video subscribe to our channel how to guys and turn on all the bell notification to stay updated and this is Kedar from how to guys sign out